guys we're here in the Berkshires fishing there's a lot of these little native trout here there's like a million of these things I give it to back to them yeah there you go I'll mouth feed yeah you. in these uncertain times take out only <laughs> there you go take it home no eating in no dining in <laughs> That is a big perch. Dude, this is my biggest perch ever. No. <laughs> Look at this perch. That's big, but Pontusa can't be. Now, for me, it is my biggest perch. I don't know. It's an eater size, baby. <laughs> You'd have to review the footage. It's big, but I think it's caught. It's big, man. Look at this thing. For a perch? Yeah. Good? Yeah. See oh, you, yeah. bud. So down the hole. That's pretty good. Man, that was a good perch. Oh, yeah. Swimming out here. Come on, buddy. Oh, there we go. Nice. Wow, these things are really... Oh, man. Slamming them now. Nice. Is it a brown? Or a native? Alright. It is just a day of trout. We've just been slamming these guys. Alright. Another trout here. A little bit bloody, but... It was just in his lip, so he should make it. It's been pretty good so far. Um, we've probably caught a dozen fish so far. Uh, we've been here a few hours and it's starting to snow, but we're going to stay till sunset and see if the sunset bite is good. It is now a snowstorm out on the ice. It's barely safe as it is. I guess this morning, over here, if you can see that hole, someone fell through right near the shore. And when we got here, a guy warned us not to go anywhere near over there. But luckily, it's only about four feet deep, three feet deep. So he probably only fell up to his waist and went right back home. But definitely don't want to be that guy. I'm trying to cook and <laughs> <laughs> at the same time. Oh, he missed them. Yeah. It out or he's robbing it. It was definitely hitting it. You can yeah. see it on the fish finder. It's when you sit in the tent for an hour and nothing bites. But as soon as you start cooking lunch, they all come up. He, he robbed it. Yeah. Looks no, like it. There. It's not mine. Fuck you, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> and I just jigged a crappy. It looked like there was a school, so I'm going to get it back in and get back to business. All right. Got this nice pickerel. Small, but within like about 30 seconds. Uh, I just got the tickle pickle jigging rod about a week ago. It's the first time I used it. Basically using the uh, diamond jig, green and orange and yellow, kind of matches the pole, but that's the first one on the new rod, so it's pretty cool. We had a double header here, Ben got a trout, and I got a trout at the same time. This is like trout number five or six for me, I think. been super hot late here in the afternoon it's now three o'clock we've been here since 10 last couple times we came here it was like really early we didn't really get any bites till like one in the afternoon so we decided today to come a little bit late and fish later in the day definitely the pre-sunset bite is way better than the early morning Yeah. Nice. Trout. Damn, that 
It's like trout seven or eight. Got a lot of these native trout. They're just, right on the corner of the lip. Yeah, yeah. Part of it is that nobody keeps them. Everyone just throws them back in, so they just yeah. stay here forever. Too small to keep. Yeah. It's kind of a good thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jigging and jumbo perch number two. That's oh, good size. Look at the size of that boy, it's huh? It's getting bigger. Hell, yeah. It's like a school one down there. Till next time, quit bitching and start fishing. If you liked our video, hit the subscribe button.